The Prime Minister and his cabinet of ministers fully embrace inclusive governance practices. St. Lucia's progress and development socially and economically require synergies and holistic collaboration among stakeholders, supported by strategic government policies. On May 14th, Prime Minister Pierre engaged private sector leaders at a first-of-its-kind consultation to advance the development of the local business sector and brainstorm potential solutions to address the challenges affecting St. Lucian businesses. So I just want to reiterate that anyone who doubts this government's commitment, and I use the word strongly, commitment, not possibly in talk and in flowery words, but in action towards the private sector, our government has done that. The Ministry of Commerce, led by Honorable Emma Hippolyt, facilitated the consultation. Business leaders provided feedback and government ministers gained insight during the productive exchange. Absolutely essential. But you know, the question for us as, a, as, a, as an association is what can we do and work with the gov in terms of working the government? We believe it is very unique um, and very timely. So we hope that with this sort of engagement, will be seen as strong and willing and able uh, stakeholders who may be able to play our part. It gives both of us a better understanding. The private sector has an opportunity on behalf of its members to communicate some of the issues and some of the concerns that they have. So we wanted to be here to at least to get the prime minister and the cabinet of ministers to understand the problems that we have government might be, able to be the one that can actually facilitate the, the creation of this entity. The needs of St. Lucian citizens and the private sector inform the policy decisions taken by the Prime Minister's cabinet. Local businesses need responsive government policies and interventions that adequately address systemic issues in the private sector. I must tell you that you have a cabinet that is, and a Prime Minister that is willing always to listen. So today we are all ears listening to you, and at the end of it, we will see how best we can shape our policies and move our country forward together. St. Lucia's private sector continues to benefit from strategic economic policy measures under Prime Minister Pierre's leadership. Ongoing tax amnesties and exemptions are strengthening balance sheets and freeing up capital. Soft loans and grant programs are encouraging investment and stimulating growth. The Prime Minister and his Cabinet of Ministers intend to convene more consultations with the private sector in the interest of the social and economic development of St. Lucia. Office of the Prime Minister.